I guess I didn't really grow up in uh, the best home environment. Um, from a young age, my my father dealt with uh, addictions to alcohol and drugs, and um, I guess by the time I was a senior in high school, 17, 18 years old, uh, my father and I were um, drinking and uh, using drugs together. By the time I was 20 years old, I was really, really going down a bad path, but then my, uh, my father uh, attempted suicide for the first time. He, has, he attempted suicide two more times and on the third time succeeded. The effect that that had on me was uh, very large. It sent me into a very, very deep downward spiral in which I did the best I could to not feel the pain, the, uh, the loss, the anger. Uh, just did everything I could to escape those feelings. Fast forward uh, five years after that event, it was five years of running, hiding, uh, and, and numbing myself with substances. Got tangled up with the wrong type of people and got into a physical altercation. Um, and I was very, very under the influence, very inebriated. And um, the police came and then I found myself in jail that night. One of the worst things about that night was the fact that there was a national television crew in the jail cell that night um, filming. Found out a few months after that whole ordeal that uh, it was a nationally aired television show and that people I know were now seeing it on TV. So after a few years of uh, isolating, uh, I decided to go back to school. And I met uh, a really good friend at school. He was going to Freedom House at the time. When I decided to go one Sunday. And when I walked into the doors of Freedom House, I can honestly say it was the first time in my life I had experienced the presence of God. I knew something was different. I had an experience uh, that I had never had before. Uh, I was being introduced to a God who loved me, who did not condemn me, who had forgiveness for me, had freedom. And uh, that is not the God that I grew up hearing about or uh, you know experiencing. Two years now I have been at Freedom House Church. Uh, a lot has happened in those two years um, and nothing nothing short of a miracle um, has taken place in my life. Uh, in the last two years I have become an, an usher here at the church. Uh, I serve on the uh, children's ministry I'm a life group leader, and of course, uh, the, the best part is I met my beautiful wife. I guess I, I just want to encourage people out there. Um, doesn't matter uh, what you've done, where you are in your life, God is there, and His arms are open, and He's a loving God. He's not a, a God who condemns you. And uh, if you have loved ones who are out there, don't ever give up on them. Uh, there is there is always hope.